Okay, so I uh, created some custom buttons today and I also did a small program to make it really easy for um, some users that might need a little bit of help to install the custom buttons and where to start. So if you've got Laser Gerbil installed and you know the COM port that it's installed on, if you don't know the COM port, you could, there are some other videos that we've posted. Um, what I've created was a small program and what this does is it simply goes in and copies the custom buttons to your folder and it copies some settings to your folder, the Laser Gerbil folder only. And basically then you reopen uh, Laser Gerbil and all your stuff done and set up for you, you can skip all of the customized buttons and so forth. So basically all you need to do is close your Laser Gerbil and then uh, run this software comes up just says what it is by me click install down here you should get a security warning uh, click it and then click yes and then it will install the files real quick all it's doing is copying a few files click finish and then when you load laser gerbil you will notice some new buttons down here and you'll notice it's a little bit different size um, there are some different settings um, nothing nothing really major basically is set most of the stuff is set still as default um, you might notice the material database has your laser or your I'm sorry your home lasers in it now and um, let's go ahead and click connect mine happens to be com7 hopefully you know where yours is so when we connect I'm going to open a file choose one I'm just going to click next and next because I just want to activate the buttons for you down here and that's all. So you'll notice now you'll have these buttons down here to turn the laser on, move around um, and I have another tutorial about that as well but that's how easy it is to install and set up with laser gerbil now. Hopefully that helps everyone. Have a good day.